So, I have this demon. I'm sure a lot of people have inner demons and they keep them at bay and it's easier for them, but mine is a lot more vocal. I've known him forever, at least I think I have. I certainly felt him at times, but only recently did I begin to get a handle on his presence. The thing is, though, I don't think he's evil or out to ruin me. I think he just hates when I'm upset, when things don't go my way. And he believes that giving into my anger and negative emotions will work because, well, keeping my composure sure won't do anything. You are so weak! I'm sick of it! Do you even try to assert yourself? Do you really want others, the world, to use you as their plaything? No. Then stop acting like it! You're just letting things happen to you instead of making them happen! Preferably with my help! He's also the reason I can't currently hold a job because he hates authority. Why are you wasting your time in here? Because I need the money. Does your boss have a magical demon also? No. I mean, I don't know. Maybe I'm still coming to terms with this. Well, he looks human, like you. He is no better than you are. So why are you acting like he's some sort of higher power? He isn't. He just has what I want, and he said if I do this for him, he'll give me some of his possessed currency. It's called economics, and it's worked for about a few thousand years. Mostly. Here. What's this? It's your weekly earnings. I stole it from his account. And his wallet. You what? Put that back now. Come on, this is a week off right here. Is there anything wrong, Todd? Uh, I'm just practicing my acting. It helps me pass the time. Okay, well, can you do it a bit more quietly? I have noticed your emotions have been running high as of late. I know, I've been dealing with a lot. Okay, just try to remain calm. Dude, you almost got me fired. Happy now? Yep, I snagged more cash while he was distracted. How's three weeks of pay sound? Long story short, that was my last day at the electronics store. Thankfully, Toby managed to magically return the cash before anyone found out. Toby? Oh, yeah, uh, Toby's an angel. Basically my conscience. I can see him, too. He's the only reason I can live my life normally, but it's pretty tough to listen to him given that the demon is so insistent. You're too smart to listen to him, and you know it. Not everything goes your way. And the important thing is to maintain your composure and live a good life. Maybe his intelligence is the problem. It's holding him back. Right, because we all know what happens when you take the wheel. Uh, no we don't, because you've always prevented him from finding out. Did it ever occur to you that maybe I've been right all along and you sticking to the script is why his life is like this? You mean with unpadded walls? Oh, that's a good one. <sighs> the worst of it is when they're fighting. Don't you get it? I just want him to be happy! You want to get him in prison or killed? If he ends up in prison, it's because you kept him from fighting back! It just paralyzes me, but typically Toby always wins out. Do you have a circle of support? Friends? Family? Well, yeah, I have friends. I think my general mental wavelength has led me to pursue interests and friendships outside of the mainstream. I tend to do better with people who are a little weird, a little alternative, who don't necessarily fit in. I mean, blood dinosaurs ain't good, but at the same time, it's bad in a way that's like... outsider art. Exactly. There's nothing else like it. Also, the art therapy's going well. I think trying to put my feelings in the cartoons has sort of helped me deal with them. I know my friends are really into my stuff, and they say they'll get me somewhere, but... I just feel like the demon is going to jeopardize things. It's not like I can get rid of him, either. He's a part of me. I see. Um, I'm assuming you don't believe me. Well, we all have different ways of confronting our feelings. Yeah, I guess. You know, I heard all that, right? Oh, shut up.